Hi, welcome back. My name is Anne. I love to sew, design, and create new things. If this is something you like to do, please subscribe and let me know in the comments below what you like to sew. Today we're making some really cute little reindeers for our Christmas tree. What we like to do actually, instead of putting bows on gifts, we put ornaments on so everyone gets a new ornament every year. You get some pretty unique ones that way. So these will probably go on some Christmas gifts this year. So the first thing I'm going to do is show you how I made the pattern so you can make it at home. So what I did was I made a circle that is four and a half inches wide. Um, it's not exactly four and a half inches wide. Um, it doesn't have to be exact. And then you, I cut out two of them because the, the first one is going to be used for the front and the back piece. And then we have to make one for the top piece for the deer. So what I did was I folded in half to make a crease. Because we want this to be halfway down on the circle. And then I just drew a line so I, I, this is what I ended up with. So I sort of just went and drew a line from here. I went about maybe two thirds, well, more than that actually. Maybe, let's see here, that far from the middle piece. And I just did a, a curve on one side, folded it in half and cut it. So that's for the reindeer's head. And then the pattern piece for the ear, I have this measured out. So I drew a line that is three inches long. I measured down one and a half inches. And then I drew a line that's two inches across. And then I just, on the one, and then I just curved over to get to that side and then curved down. And then bottom we want to measure about two inches. But not quite because you want it to be a little smaller than that piece. And then for the ears, you're going to be cutting out two pieces for the back and one for the inside. And for the antlers for the, the boy reindeer, I just cut a piece that the best I could to look like a antler and it's about three quarters of an inch wide and it's two inches long. Let's see here, maybe two and a half inches long. So those are the pieces that I'm using. So the materials I'm using, I actually had a couple of throw pillow covers that I wasn't using, so I took them apart because they were the perfect colors for the reindeers and the antlers. And then I have an off-white cotton for the rest of it. So I'm using um, an off-white cotton for the bottom of the face here and um, a pink cotton for the inside of the ear. And um, so I've cut these out. You're, for each one, you're gonna need one circle of the this piece, one of the cotton, and a little piece of the brown and then for the back of the ears and the in, and the pink for the inside of the ears. And then um, for the antlers, um, I cut out, so I cut this out, I traced it onto the piece of fabric twice and then I sewed it before I cut it. So we'll take care of those in a minute. So the first thing we have to do is sew this piece onto the circle. and then the ears. I already stitched out the antlers earlier.
So now that I have the ears and this piece sewn together, um, we're going to put the eyes and the nose on first before we sew anything else together. And I bought a package of these. I got these off Amazon. They come with all these different types of eyes and little noses and stuff. Um, so I'm going to be using these for the eyes and the nose. And if you don't have these, you can always embroider them with um, embroidery floss or even um, I even tried with fabric markers and it works really well to just, just draw the nose and the eyes on. For the ears, we're just going to fold them in like this. And we're gonna put them on, so just measure it up to the top edge like that. So they'll be even on both sides. Sometimes I want to check to make sure I folded it in so they're both the same size. I think I might put a mouth on her. And for this one, Now we'll do the antlers.
I tied up some twine. Um, I chose this because it has a nice um, gold metallic ribbon going right through it. You could use ribbon or whatever you'd like. And I decided to also draw little mouths on them. And I just used a fabric marker for that. And so now I'm going to be going to the sewing machine and just stitch, a close, to, stitch close to the edge all these to tack them down. So now we have to pin these together. At the bottom, we're just gonna mark um, a little opening here at the bottom. And we're gonna sew right around and leave that open. So I have them all stitched around the edge and I'm just gonna Put in little cuts all the way around. So after I stitched out the bottoms, I added some bows as the finishing touch, and there you have it. Two really cute little reindeer, very easy to make. I hope you enjoy making this. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't yet subscribed, please subscribe and have a great day. We'll see you soon. Bye for now.